Each year, hurricane season brings challenges for those living in affected areas, but this year has been especially rough. As a community of artists, we know all too well that creativity can be a beacon of hope. We have chosen to come together to raise money for people who have been impacted by these catastrophic events. We've created videos for you to enjoy and art for you to bid on. Fluid Art Co. has stepped up to do something very special. They've offered to sponsor the collaboration with a limited release pigment that they've named Benevolence. Five dollars of every jar sold will go towards the fund. Proceeds will be going to the Direct Relief Organization. From all of us around the globe, we thank you for taking this on with us. Hey guys, it's Jody. Today's video, we're gonna paint. <laughs> I'm so excited. <laughs> I was asked to be a part of this amazing collaborative effort uh, to raise money for Hurricane Relief Fund and I couldn't say no. I'm like, I have to get my paint out. I have to do this. So here we are. We're going to paint today. Um, you're seeing my video on uh, one of the last days of the collaboration. So I hope you've enjoyed all the other videos. And by now you've already seen most of the other artists and their amazing, amazing art that they've created in their videos. Uh, what we're doing is we are creating all of these pieces to be auctioned off on November 3rd. I believe it's at noon central time on Nate Bright's art YouTube channel and I'll put all the links down below in the description box and I'll also put the playlists down below if you've missed any of them but we're raising money for a, a, well, an organization that's called directrelief.org to help the, uh, everybody who's been affected by the hurricanes. Also, the Fluid Art Company created a pigment uh, called Benevolent, and it is strictly just for this fundraiser. And once once they're sold out, they're sold out. And I, by the time you're seeing my video, I don't, I'm not sure of the status of it. But if there's still jars left, go grab them because five dollars from every jar sold is going towards this hurricane relief fund. So. I've got a time crunch with this video, so I won't be showing you a lot of the consistencies and what I'm using and all that, but per usual, it's all going to be down below in the description box. So without further ado, let's go get started painting. All right, so I'm going to go over the colors really quickly. We've got this little piggy in Aspen. Looks like that. We've got uh, Boom Gel Pearlescent Teal. One of my favorites, Josonia Black Umber. And then the new piggy, which um, I don't have a container for yet, uh, Benevolence, but you can kind of see what that looks like there. And then the Liquitex Light Blue Permanent here. And then the cell activators I'm gonna be using, I will be using um, Amsterdam White. Amsterdam Oxide Black, and then my mixture of PBO Studio Acrylics, Iridescent Precious Gold, and then, oops, let's show you that, and then the Atelier Interactive Pale, Go, Pale Gold, these mixed together, uh, all in the Australian Float Trawl. Again, everything's going to be down below in the description box. Now for my canvas, I've got a 14 by 18 canvas and I'm going to get this loaded up with my pillow which is the PPG Multi Pro. <laughs> Take two. I scrapped the first one. I did not like it. I'm just going to put a little bit of the gold down this time. I think I put too much gold last time. Like right. In the middle there. It's 
doesn't have to be perfect. Aspen and then the black umber. The teal boom gel. This beautiful benevolence, what does that remind you of? My beautiful blue black that I love so much. All right. Let's not be shy with this. And the light blue. I'm just going to use the, the black and the white cell activator. Some black right here. here and then we're gonna go over to the spinner box it's kind of what that looks like that was really fun to do let's hope this one works out well all right give it a good spin talking about this is a lot more organic than the last one I tried to do let's see still some movement in the middle I don't want to take too much more off Love just the hints of gold behind it too. This is perfect. Oh, I love this. Oh my god, I love this. This was so much fun. <laughs> oh, I was so discouraged with the last one too. I was like, oh man, it's been a minute. But you know what? Yeah. Not really getting any movement either. Oof, I love this. I love this so much. Okay. I just want just a little tiny bit off here. Just a little baby spin, maybe. All right. Good. Oh, yeah. 
no, no movement. Yep. Yep. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. All right, I'm gonna get cleaned up and I will bring you over for the flyover. Ooh, I really like it that way. I think that's my favorite. I just wanted to come back on here and thank you so much for being here and for following our collaborative effort. I had so much fun putting this piece together. It just really, it ignited something more in me and just seeing all of the other artists and their pieces and what they've done and how different they are. It makes me want to try all these new different things. So I'm excited to go and paint some more. And if you haven't checked out uh, any of the other videos or only some of the videos i've got the playlists down below in the description box and all the information that you need for the auction that's coming up as well as the link for the jars if there's still benevolent jars left so thank you so much for being here and i'll see you at the next video mm -hmm.